Hi everybody, it's Kathy and welcome to today's workout. Today is strength day and we're going to be doing our strength workout in an AMRAP style. So AMRAPs is as many reps as possible. Your first three blocks will be four minutes. Your last three will be five minutes. We're gonna cover every single muscle group and some. Um, AMRAPs are great because it's you get to work at your own pace. Now you should always be working at your own pace, but sometimes when we do rep work together, you know, sometimes you may feel forced to go a little faster or uh, maybe drop down your weights a little bit. So this is a time that you can really hone in and focus on what you need to do to get the workout done. So obviously the faster you get through the exercises, the more reps, the more times you do it. But speed isn't always the answer. It's just really pushing yourself and learning how to uh, adapt and push yourself the hardest you possibly can in that little block of time. All right, so let's get started with the warm up. Let me just explain what you need here. I've got three full sets of weights. I'm gonna be working with 12s, 15s, and 20s today. Um, so pick some weights that's gonna challenge you and have your options readily available. All right, some water towel, all that good stuff. So let's get ready with our warm up. We're gonna start with our shoulder, our feet shoulder width apart. We're gonna roll the shoulders back, our core is nice, gonna be engaged. We're gonna reach for our toes and we're gonna drive up onto our tiptoes and shoot those arms overhead. Sit back and shoot. So called total body squats. So you're kind of working the entire body here and shooting up, driving onto those tiptoes, warming up those calves. Breathe, exhale, try to keep your gaze forward. Good work, keep it moving. We're going for 10 more seconds. Nice work. Nice, four, three, two, and one. Tap and reach, so just reaching out side to side, reaching for that toe on each side. Nice. Reach, reach. Good. Getting lower each time as your body starts to warm up. Good. Nice and strong. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Step it out nice and wide. Crisscross those arms. Good, nice wide stance, head up, shoot those arms open wide, stretch through that back and chest. Excellent. Perfect, eight more. Six, five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna go into a little skier, side to side swing. So, you are gonna be doing a skier swing later on. So a skier swing is just hip hinge and letting those arms propel forward from the power in your hips. So right now have nice light arms, let those hips propel those arms forward, hips go back. You got it, nice and easy. Let's do eight more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go into a side to side reach. Reach for that back heel. Opposite arm comes up. Sit your hips back. Breathe. Nice, gonna feel that rotation work going through your waistline. We're going eight more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, we're gonna come into a lunge. You're gonna give me a lunge power. So you're gonna bring that knee up, step back and switch. So it's a lunge, power knee, step back and switch. Good, lunge, power, lunge, switch. Lunge, power, lunge, switch. Pump those arms, good job. Power, bend back, nice work. Back, up, beautiful. Last six here. Five, 
four more. Three, two to go. Last one here. Awesome work. Now just gonna come down, touch your toes, jack it out. Wide stance, tap, jump, jack. Whoo, breathe it out. Last 12, 11, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Just stay here and hold. Good work. Just hold it back. Feel those legs. Breathe. You got about 12 seconds left. Inhale, exhale. Nice work. Good. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bring your hands to the floor. Step your right leg back. Just give yourself a nice big strong rotation on that side. Nice work. Step it in. Switch sides. Rotate. I'm going to do that one more time each way. Nice work. Step it back. Switch sides. Good job. And let's do that one more time. Other side right here. Perfect. Now just step your back foot in. You're going to be in a nice wide stance. Just a little sink yourself side to side. Good work for four, three, two, one. Hike those hips. Oh, big stretch here. Pull your body up. Give yourself some nice strong shoulder rolls. Good. Take them forward. Big shoulder rolls here. Nice work. Crisscross those arms. Shake it out here. Nice. Grab a nice big stretch with those elbows. Pull them back. Excellent work. Just going to go into four quads, quad, calf stretches here, quad stretches, I should say. Here we go. Good. You got one more each leg. All right, guys, we are ready to rock and roll. All right, so it's four minutes. Now you'll have three exercises and you'll be doing 10 reps of all three of these exercises. Remember, you're going to go at your own pace. We may start together. We may not finish together. So don't be, keep up with the Joneses. You keep up with you. So your first move is gonna be an alternating hammer curl lunge. So it's just gonna be one, two, full range of motion. I don't wanna see this going on with your arms. All right, you control up, you control down, alternating sides for 10. Then you're just gonna go into a reverse lunge for 10, alternating legs. Then you're going into a wide sumo deadlift squat for 10. Back to your alternating lunge, uh, arms, alternating lunges, back to your sumo deadlifts. Each one is 10 reps. First two are alternating. The last one is um, full range here. Four minutes, guys. All right. I'm going to grab 20s for my first two exercises. Actually, all three. I'm going to stay with 20 pounds as long as I can. All right. Here comes your four minutes hammer curls. One. Two elbows glued, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten lunges. One. Now you may be faster than me, too. These are all very straightforward exercises. Four chest high. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. And 10, feet wide, toes flared out, weights in front, down, up, one. Don't round forward, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, squeeze those inner thighs, 10, beautiful, from the top, one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Reverse lunges. How are you doing? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Wide stance. Toes flared out. One, 
two, let your legs do the work here. Three, core's engaged. Four, five, six, stand and squeeze. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. You're halfway, guys. You've got two minutes. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, lunges. All right, you want to flow from each exercise for the other. Three, four, five. So if you need a break, take it. Six, but try to get through this. Seven, eight, nine, stay as heavy as you can. 10, sumos, toes flare out. One, two, when you stand, squeeze your inner thighs. Come on. Eight, nine, and 10. I might've skipped one here, hammer curls. Two, three, four, this is your last minute. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lunges. Good work. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten sumos here. Ha one, up two, three, four, five, yes, six, seven, eight, nine. Woo! Back to your alternating arms. I'm gonna stay with doubles. We only have seven seconds. Mm. And four minutes is done. Nice work. So you should have been getting at least four full rounds there. Nice work. Ooh, grab some water. Yikes. All right, rate should be high. Roll out those arms. Nice. Okay. Towel off if you need to. Ooh, it's got a quick little shoulder stroll here. Stretch. Nice. We'll just go into a quick little side to side stretch. All right, we're moving on. So we are going to be going back. We're going to actually be doing some upper back. We're going to be doing some squats. And we're going to do some skier swings, which is also going to work the back. It's going to work your core. It's going to work your heart rate. It's going to work just about everything. So here's your three moves. Again, this is four minutes, 10 reps. These are full reps, not alternating. You're gonna roll your shoulders back, feet are a little wider than the shoulder width apart. You're gonna hinge down, palms facing your legs. You're gonna give me 10 high pull delt rows. If you need to alternate, you can. All right, from there, you're going into a double pulse squat. So that's one, two pulses at the bottom and two. Then you're going into skier swings. Notice where my arms are here. I'm hinging, coming up. The more of a hinge I get, the more power in my arms. So I don't want to see this going on. All right, I don't want to see that going on. You should not be lifting with your arms. My first round, I'm going to do 15s. My second and all the rest. On my skiers, I'm going to do 20 pounders. All right, so it's going to force me to have to work a little bit harder. All right, we've got four minutes on the clock. 10 second countdown. Grab, inhale, exhale. Delt rows. To start, grab your weights. You should have heavy here. 12, 15 should be really good if you have them. Here we go. Row it up. One, two, back is flat. Three, lead with your elbows. Four, five, six, seven, concentrate. Eight, nine, and 10. Double pulse, 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 and stand. Squeeze your glutes when you stand. So I want you to fully come up out of your squat. Three, weight in your heels, light on your toes. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
skier swings, back and forth. One, two, I'm gonna give you a side view. Three, four, wherever those arms are, five is where they are. Six, so lift them. Seven, eight, nine, and 10 from the top, delt rows. 10, nine, eight, seven, come on. Six, five, four, three, two, double pulse squats, pulse, pulse and stand, one, up, two, three, four, five, don't look down, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, go with those 20 skier swings. Hinge, one, two, three, four, power, five, six, seven, eight, nine, notice where my arms are, and 10, going into those down flies, down rows. Let's go, 10, nine, eight, seven, oh, five, six, feeling these, five, four, three, two, ah, uh, double pulse, one, one, uh, two, this is catching up to me, how about you, three, four, nice, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, my skiers for 10, one, two, three, arms along for the ride, four, five, six, I feel these in my back, seven, my upper back, six, two more, and, woo, Del Rose, last round, guys. Eight, seven, six, five, four, how you doing? Three, two, one, double pulse. Back is flat, head is forward. Three, four, five, six, you doing good? Stand, seven, eight, you're almost done, guys. Nine, I'm gonna stay with my 15s here. You've got 12 seconds. Two, three, whoo, four, I'm feeling these. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and time. Oh, whoo, ha, ah, I totally felt those. Towel off, yikes. All right, should have felt those. I was feeling my deltoids in my front, feeling my deltoids in my back, feeling my legs and my heart rate was coming up, which is what you want. That's very metabolic. All right, grab some water. We've got one more round of four minute drills. Then we move on to fives. Okay, so this one you're gonna stay down onto the floor. All right, let's just go into a couple of stretches here. Give yourself a nice little hinge here. Nice work. Pull those arms back, stretch through those shoulders and back here. All right, so this one is gonna require one heavier set of weights. Maybe the heaviest you have. All right, I'm gonna be using my 20s. The first two are body weight. <clears throat> so the first one is push-ups. All right, so you're gonna give me 10 push-ups. You know how to do them, body weight. Hands are wide, a little wider than shoulder width apart, elbows out. You do 10, either on your knees or full body, and then you're gonna lower down into a form. You're gonna give me a hip twist. You're just gonna drop your hip to the left. You're gonna drop your hip to the right. 10 alternating sides. And then you're gonna to come to the heaviest weight you have, and you're gonna give me 10 floor rows, all right? So each time you bring it down, it's an alternating side. Back to your push-ups, back to your planks, back to your rows. So I'm just gonna have my, my rows, my weights here, 
You want them even with your shoulders. All right, I'm gonna have to do my push-ups right next to it in my plank so I can tr transition right into it. All right, getting my four minute timer. I want you to give me the best push-ups you can, guys. All right, we've got four minutes with a 10 second countdown. All right, I'm gonna put this up here. Best push-ups you can give me, guys. Core strong, booty tucked down. Here we go, 10. Seven, six, neck long, five, four, three, two, and one. Coming into those forearms, dropping the hips for 10, for nine, for eight, seven, six, five. Full rotation, four, three, two, and one. Over to your weights, 10 rows. 10, nine, eight, elbow comes all the way up. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh, I like those floor rows. All right, going back to your push-ups. Here we go. 10, nine, eight, Seven, where's your head? Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Plank twist. My chest is sore from my workout yesterday. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10 floor rows, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. You guys keep moving, going into 10 push-ups. My hands are slip sliding. I gotta put my towel down. All right, 10, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, 10. Sometimes push ups are harder depending upon the day. 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, booty down. Seven, eight, nine. Woo! Ah, love those hip twists. For ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, woo! Three, two, ah! All right, come on. You got push ups, guys. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, seconds. Two, three, all the way up. Four, five, six, ah, seven, eight, nine, woo, ten. You got four seconds. I'm not going to start with my push-ups in three, two, one. Oh, yikes. Shake it out. Open up those arms. Beautiful. So working, let's bring those fingertips behind your ears, open up that chest. Nice, pull your hands back, squeeze those shoulder blades together, puff that chest out. Those floor rows, guys, if you have a heavy weight, they're awesome because that dead weight, when you push down and have to come back up, whoo, it's so good for your core 
and those upper and that upper arm and back working with chest win combination all right all right guys come up to a standing position let's towel off let's grab some water the last three rounds are five all right oh man that one got me all right you know how some days you're just feeling really good and you're just feeling like you know i can do anything i'm super strong then there are days where we're a little bit draggy i'm a little bit draggy because i did a substantial workout yesterday so it's very understandable so i just have to be mindful and make sure i take a nice recovery day all right so here's what we got we're going into 10 squat rotational presses so i'm going to probably use uh, let's see i don't know maybe a 15 here or maybe a 12. so you're going to hold the weight like this you're going to bring it to one side you're going to rotate up and around so when you come up you press it and then you go to the other side you press it each side is one all right so that's 10 alternating sides and then we're going to go into an alternating front raise so it's just one two all right you've got 10 alternating front raises and then we're going to go into who oh, i might need 12s for these it's a squat curl stand and press all right you've got 10 of those those are going to creep up on you that is why i did five minutes here it's going to chew up some clock all right one weight let me get into my five minute time mode. Remember, you might be with me, you might not be with me. You do you, have your weights ready to go. Sometimes I say start lighter, get the law of the land and then see how your body feels. We're going in two and one rotation, down and up. One, two, three, four, Five, try to get that weight to the outside of your heel. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Either pick up the mate or a lighter set. Front raises for 10, nine, eight, seven. Make sure you're not doing this. Six, five, you can always stagger your stance. Four to support your back. Three, two, and one, all right, we've got our sumus. Straight down, low curl, stand and press. Up, two, three, this isn't so easy. Four, five, six, seven, Rotational press. See how that really chewed up some time. One, two. So you might not get as many rounds in this one. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, oh, ten. Front raises. 10, 9, 8, brush your ass, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I'm going to lighten my load here with 12s for the sumos. Down, 1. The reason being is I want to try to go a little bit faster so I can get a few more in. 3, the weights are kind of bogging me. Can I do them? Yes. But since this is an AMRAP, ah, I want to try to get as many reps in as possible. This is six, seven, eight, nine. Nice. Here's ten. Woo! Rotation now. One. Two, three, four, five, 
six, you hear me breathing, right? Seven, eight, nine, ah, and 10, front raise, one, two, three, oh, four, feeling these, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, you guys, you can also go down to one weight instead of two. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh my God. Oh, seven. Yikes. Woo! And 10. Oh, 42 seconds. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do four and four. One, two, three, four. Front raises. One, two, three, four, 20 seconds. One, two, three, oh, up, four, and time now. Oh, for me, that was brutal. I don't know about for you. A lot of shoulder, heart rate, core. So if your heart rate is up, notice how your heart rate's coming up without doing anything crazy. No cardio, it's all metabolic. Grab some water, we'll shake out those arms. We're gonna go onto the floor. We're gonna do some chest and some bridging. So what you're gonna want, is you're gonna probably want two sets of weights because one's gonna be chest, one's gonna be tricep, one's just gonna be body, uh, kind of a weighted move, all right? so. Whew, I'm gonna use my 12s for my tricep and I'm gonna use my 15s for my chest. All right, let me get my timer down here. We're gonna come onto our back. Let me just give you an FYI of what is going. Again, this is five minutes, so I want you to take your time to get um, every bit of range of motion. All right, so here's what you got for your first one. It's a fly and knee extension, all right? so. You are going to let me move these weights just a little bit up. All right, so you're gonna come onto your back. Your knees are gonna be up. Your arms are gonna be up. You're gonna fly and you're gonna extend one knee, leg, and then you're gonna extend the other leg. If that is too hard, keep your knees right where they are. All right, from there, you're going to come into a bridge. And I'm gonna lighten my load. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna tricep extend, bend the elbows and lift. I might stay with my 15s, maybe the first round or so. So you drop your booty, bend your elbows, and lift for 10, and then you're gonna take your weight, you're gonna come onto a really high tiptoe, drop and lift, tiptoe bridge for 10. Back to your flying extend, back to your tricep, so on, so forth. All right, we're starting with the chest, fly and extend. Remember, it's 10 of each round. All right, knees up, arms up, extend one leg, flex through that heel, one, two, push through that heel, Three, extend, four, five, get that full extension in your chest, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, coming into that bridge, one, lift, two, your elbows stay pointed center, three, do not move your arms except to bend it. Four, five, six, seven, eight, uh, nine, and oh, 10. Oh, all right. Walk those feet in, rise onto your tiptoes. One, two, so work in their calves here. Three, four, five, 
six, keep those heels elevated. Seven, eight, nine, each time squeeze your booty at the top. 10, all right, back to our flying extend for 10, for nine, looking at my timer, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, so you're working your abs, and one, I'm gonna go to my 12s, triceps. All right, you can also alternate arms here. One, two, three, truth be told, four, I could probably have stuck with my 15s, but I would've gone a lot slower. Six, I wanna get as many reps as possible. Seven, eight, nine. So there's kind of like, you gotta figure out what's most important to you. Weight's on your thighs. Walk your feet in, lift your heels. One, two, each time squeeze. Three, four, five, six, mm, seven, all the way up and down. Eight, nine, and 10. Ah, that chest fly, I'm gonna grab my 15s. Two and a half minutes, guys. Pull those knees up. Now, if you can, you can do both legs. All right, so if you want to do that, Different folk strokes for different folks, so if your abs can handle it, give it a whirl. Woo. All right, go with my triceps. Bend, extend, they're on either side of your ear as you drop your booty down too. Three, four, five, six, seven, woo, eight, nine, and oh. All right, walk those feet in. Drop and lift one, drop and lift two. Make sure you're getting full range of motion here. Four. Five, keep the heels low, elevated. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, going into, we got a minute, 10 seconds left. See how many we can get. One, two, three, four, feel those abs. Five, six, Seven, oh, eight, you're hugging a beach ball. Nine, and 10, woo, 40 seconds, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, oh, seven, hello, triceps. Eight, nine, and 10, tiptoe it up. Let's go. One, uh, two, all the way up and down. Three, four, five, six. Timer's gotta be close. Seven, eight, nine, 10. Woo, where's our timer? I'm done. Oh, wait, no, we've got one more round. I thought that was done. Woo, we got one more round here. Ah. Ha, 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 ha. Let's go. What was I thinking? Let's go here. I thought that was it. Oh, my God. Oh. Yes. Whoo. Bring your hands 
back behind you. Let your head drop. So just feel that stretch in your chest there. Awesome. All right. Give yourself a nice bend in that elbow. Some serious triceps, guys. Whew. All right. Shake it out. Nice work. All right. We have one more uh, drill left. And it is it's five minutes. But four of the minutes are going to be a uh, cardio, um, a cardio uh, core power sequence. Then the very last minute, so it's four minutes of that. And then the very, very last minute, you're gonna give me a hollow hold ab for one full minute. All right, so since I'm down here right now, I'm gonna show you what a hollow hold will look like. This is all body weight, by the way. All right, so a hollow hold is you are gonna scoop the belly, you're gonna bring your arms. Now level one, you'll be here, and you will hold as long as you can. So if you can play with the arms, you'll play with the arms. If you can play with the legs, you'll play with the legs. You will always come back to here if you're tired. Level two or three or four or whatever you're at, you're scooping and holding. All right, so your legs are hovering, your arms and shoulders are off, and you are scooping and building so much core. All right, so that'll be your last final minute. The other three exercises are side taps. These are quick. You'll do 10 alternating sides. Then we're going to go into toe jumps. You're going to reach your toes. You're going to jump up. You're going to do 10. And then we're going to go into 10 quick power knees each side. Flowing through that for four full minutes. After the fourth minute, we're on the floor with that one minute hollow hold. All right? So grab some water if you need it. This is your last and final drill. So we're gonna work some cardio, we're gonna work some core. We're gonna finish super, super strong. Okay, five minutes on the clock. Remember, cardio is a little bit faster, so I want you to go at a faster pace and get more rep, reps in. Keeping this body weight, you got eight seconds. Make sure that your weights are nowhere in your way. I don't want you tripping on anything. Three, two, one. Here we go, one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now level one is out of a jump, you'll just stand. Otherwise, it's a jump. Two, three, four. Working those calves. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, power. Knee. One, two, three, four. Head up. Five, six. Seven, eight, nine, filling my legs already. Ten, one, two, three, four, five, just spring it up. Six, seven, eight, woo, nine, and ten. Woo, here we go. One, two, so you can just rise on those toes. Three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ooh. Power. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh my God, I'm feeling these. Seven, eight, nine. Hello. Let's go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. All right. Side taps in three, two, one. Let's go. One. Two. Now really reach here. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Toe, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Whew. Power, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, uh, eight, 
nine, 10. Oh, my poor legs, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Uh, all right, guys, come on. Ooh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's go. One. This will be your last round. Two, three, four. Come on. Five, six, seven. You can do this. Eight, nine. Power me. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight. Keep powering. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Quickly switch. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Oh, leave me on the floor. One minute, hollow. Come on, let's do this. Scoop. Come on, hollow those legs. Level one here. So even if you maybe try this for maybe two seconds and you come back, scoop. Lift that upper body. Yeah. Can always bring those arms up here. Oh. Let me look at a time frame here. Can't see this. Oh, keep going. Ha. Ah. 18 seconds. Let's go. Fight. 10, 9, 8, 7, shoulders up, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh. Oh. So truth be told, that is probably one of the better ab exercises if you want to see rock solid abs. A hollow hold. A hollow hold and a plank. They're gonna change your body if you do them more consistently. Woo! Planks work your body 360 degrees at hollow hold sculpts because it's an isometric. Anything isometric like a plank is going to really work. All right, just hug it, rock side to side. Beautiful, bring those arms up, hands to the floor. Just gonna drop both legs over and then bend those knees. Good. And then extend those legs long. Lift them up one more time. All the way over. Oh boy. And then bend. Beautiful. Extend. Bring them up. Bring both legs to the floor long. Take your left leg and bring it all the way over. I want you to try to touch your outstretched hand. There's no way you will, but you can try. Do the same thing on the other side. Big reach over. Oh. And up, I'm gonna do that again. Come on, big step, reach. Oh, you're gonna feel that hip lifting towards the sky. <sighs> nice, come on, one more time on this side. Actually, we're gonna do it one more round. Oh, my feet are hitting, my weights are everywhere. Here we go. <sighs> Good, and let's do that one more time, guys. Mm, oh boy, that one feels really good. Woo! Awesome work. Now, just lay onto your side, grab that foot, keep that knee in line with your hip, and just pull that elbow back. Nice work. Just extend that leg. Let's roll over to the other side, do the same thing. Just pull that knee straight back. Perfect. And come on, up to a seated position. Nice work, I want you to sit up super, super tall. I want you to reach back to your right arm and then reach back to the left. Just toe tap with your pinky, tap it down. Good, you're gonna do one more here. Beautiful, 
Bring those hands behind you, fingertips press away, open up that chest, let that head fall back. Open up that chest and feel that. Whew. All right, sitting up nice and strong, bring your fingertips to one side of your hip, bring them up and over, kind of make a little bit of a rainbow here for four, for three, for two, for one. Interlace your hands in front of you. I want you just to lean forward, kind of reach past your toes if you can, tuck your chin and reach forward. Just feel a low, uh, big stretch through your spine. Excellent, and coming forward, take your left leg, cross it over your right, drag that foot all the way up until you cannot go anymore. Give that knee a nice big hug, feeling a release right there, hug it in, pitch your body forward to so really feel that burning lactic acid in there. All right, that bottom leg, I want you to extend it, plant that foot to the floor, give yourself a nice strong rotation, look over that back shoulder, stretching through our spine here. Perfect, coming back to center, we do the same thing on the other side, cross it over, figure four, drive that heel, just coming in and in and in and in until you can't go anymore, and then hug, should feel this right here. It's a great release. Pitch your body forward to get a deeper stretch. Easy peasy breathing. Exhale, now extend that leg long. Plant that foot to the floor. Give yourself a nice strong rotation over that shoulder, bringing out that washcloth in your torso. Perfect, all right. We're gonna rock ourselves forward. We're gonna slowly bring ourselves forward. Hike those hips to the sky. Bend, oh, push that tailbone up. Yes, nice forward fold. You're gonna come up halfway. Let's swing our arms left to right. Just get a nice loosey-goosey stretch and then let's take it front to back. Same thing, flippity flop with those arms. Give yourself some little alternating circles and then reverse them, stretching through that shoulder and back and now let those hands hang. Bring your body up the rest of the way. Squeeze your shoulders to your ear. Take the heels of your palm, push them away. We're gonna do one more time. Exhale, big, big giant step out. Inhale, hands come to heart center. Give yourself a round. Fabulous job, guys. I hope you liked your Metcon AMRAP. I felt this one today. Hope you did too. Continue to work hard, continue to be consistent, and you will see those changes occurring, all right? Push the envelope, go heavier if you can. Remember to hydrate protein and make sure you plan for recovery days and core days and lighter days as well. All right, stay well. I will see you on our next workout. Take care, everybody. Bye.